Hello everybody and welcome to FreeTradingVideos.com. It is Friday, June 5th, 2009 and uh, the markets are digesting some news right now. Pretty incredible. Let's uh, look at that. But this is the S&P 500 three minute chart uh, af you know, after market and pre-market information. You can see the volume even pre-market here coming in. It's pretty impressive. So what's going on today? Investing stocks on Yahoo Finance economic. Scroll to the bottom and here are all the things that are coming out. So you can, you can see there's a lot. Unemployment rate is probably going to be a big one. Uh, Non-farm payrolls, hourly earnings, average work week, uh, productivity. Those were yesterday. So unemployment rate, consumer credit will be at two. People were, were kind of anticipating that this unemployment rate number was going to be better than expected. And uh, here it is. So pretty powerful. We'll see if it can hold up on that. But that's going to look like a huge up gap if it were to open right now from the close. And even yesterday was a fantastic finish. Uh, but it was up into this resistance, remember? Not to make too much of it. Right now it's trading at 95.80 or so. One little spike up to 96. So all the people feeling like they've missed out on the trade, trying to jump on. But typically that's... <laughs> Maybe the best time not to jump on. So we'll see again. So 95 to 96 range. What's great about this is the 95 is the lower part of that. And that's above this resistance that we were looking to fight through yesterday. So let's see what's above that. Wow. Excellent. 96 right in here. So this becomes a range. Very narrow one, at least on daily chart. But that is a perfect gap fill. Let me go back and get that line. It's subtle, but it's there. So this whole thing becomes a range. There's 96. There's 95, 33 area. Let's go ahead and drop them in since that's what we're working on right now. Above that, we've got the $100 mark. I would say that before this swing high back here. So that's what we're going to chew on next. Those areas of resistance. So that would be a fantastic thing to see. If it holds up here and trades, make sure that all those people on the daily chart have been let out of pain. We'll have a chance maybe to make a run. But again, watch very, very carefully how the market uh, works off this news, especially after it's been extended for so long. Uh, make sure you do the same thing with your other relative strength and weakness stocks. See how they react. And I uh, look forward to talking to you guys at uh, around noon. It's fantastic. So the trend, trend Q, VIX also. Uh, make sure they're doing what they quote unquote should be doing. We'll want to see the VIX bleed out while the trends are marching lower but not so overextended to the downside that it's too bullish to put money on the table. So very good. Trade well everybody and I'll be talking to you at noon.